This weekend, Indiana native Scott Rowland gets inducted into the Baseball Hall of Fame. And it's a particularly special moment for a Carmel mother who will be in Cooperstown to see it all happen. As our Dan Spieler explains now, her young son lost his fight with cancer, but gained a forever friend. Tyler Frenzel was just seven years old when his mom Pam got the unthinkable news. Her son had leukemia. It happened very quickly, right before Christmas. Um, kind of wor parents' worst nightmare. Tyler loved baseball, so his gym teacher, a former ball player himself, connected him with a big league legend, soon to be Hall of Famer, Scott Rowland. We got to go down on the field and batting practice. But Tyler's trip to St. Louis to meet Roland was just the start of their relationship. They bonded and he started to follow Tyler's story, his progress. He was very interested in how things were going and just wanted to help. Tyler is the best defender I've ever seen in my life. He's lived more in nine years than I, than I could ever, ever imagine. You know, any of us living our entire lives. Tyler passed away just a few months before his 10th birthday, but his legacy lived on through the charities he inspired and for Roland himself. His daughter's middle name is Tyler, all thanks to the young fan from Indiana who inspired so many along the way. Wow, you know, this, this Tyler's name's carried on and it's just special, I mean. What an honor. So now, as Roland is enshrined into the Hall of Fame this weekend, Tyler's mom, Pam, will be there. We spoke to her from the airport Thursday. To me, it's full circle. It's a full circle moment for um, Tyler and Scott. And I know Scott knows Tyler's gonna be there. He's a Hall of Famer more so to me, not because of the baseball, because of who he is as a person. And I think about that now, almost 20 years later, wow, but this young man, you know, entered into that emotional pain. And that says a lot about his character. There's no way I'd miss it. Our thanks to Dan Spieler for that story. Tyler was the inspiration between Tyler, behind Tyler's Treehouse at Camp Emma Lou near Lake Monroe. It's a camp for families who are experiencing illness or other hardships so they can enjoy a quiet getaway. We have a link at cbs4indy.com. Now, as for Scott Rowland, the Jasper native will be honored in Cooperstown this weekend, along with Anderson native and former Dodger Carl Erskine, who's receiving a Lifetime Achievement Award at the Hall of Fame on Sunday. Boy, Very well deserved. Very there well, as well deserved. Boy, Carl Erskine, what a, what a great guy, too.